What is up, everybody? Blue Dog Thirty Five here. This is episode three of Vigilante Eight. Uh, we got Dave and Convoy lined up for this one, so uh, let's get right into it. Dave. Hmm. Since you show no intelligent lie. <laughs> ah, man. Yeah, yeah. I think that every time I look in the mirror. So we'll go to the Valley Farms. Dave sets out for New Mexico following reports of UFO sightings in that region. Not far into his trip, he gets ambushed by some weapon-wielding dudes. Dave fights back. Gotta protect the windmills, I think it said. Actually, you know what? I completely forgot that I have weapons already. So... Beeswax V Dave. Oh. Okay, I like that. I can get down with that. Ah, he's running. Oh, you are not gonna get a friggin'. Oh, he's gonna get a. I think he's gonna shield. Yeah, he's gonna shield. Alright, we're gonna follow him. He's gonna go and double shield? Hmm. What is your play, Vitruvian man? Come on, shield. Be over. Okay, it's over. That was easy. idea what he said. Aircraft Graveyard is next. All roads lead to the Aircraft Graveyard. Hmm. Lucky for Dave, a tough guy named John Torque shows up and chases the thugs away. Torque invites Dave to join the vigilantes. Together, they pursue thugs to Arizona. Alright. This is Dave's special. Okay. Actually get to show off a special this time. Let's wait until his, uh, his thing goes away. But I get to do this. Oh, no. They're attacking me. So, yeah. Uh, what his special does is it calls down some UFOs. To, uh, cause shenanigans. <laughs> oh, I get hit by the plane. Rest in peace. To the Hoover Dam we go. Dave questions the logic of it all, but decides to stick around. Besides, he was just asked to investigate coyote activity at the Hoover Dam. Far out! Protect the Transformers. I mean, do they actually need protecting, or can they, they can protect themselves, I think, yeah? Uh, how on mines... God. Oh, 
Well, at least we got darts. I mean, that works too. More darts? Yes. I don't think he had anything but mines in the special, so... Yeah. There we go. Hey, my calculations have been proven co accurate. <laughs> All right, so our final stop is Ghost Town. <sighs> When Dave learns that Coyote Loki used to work at Site 4, he decides to track him down. Loki is easy to find, but he sure isn't interested in talking about aliens. Bummer. Gotta protect the Indian village. And I also need to find a weapon. I need a weapon. I'm like Master Chef. I will take those. Yes, I will. All right, we are stacked. I just need the tumbleweed to come off. There we go. We've got six uses of our special. There goes Molo. I am going to... Uh... Oh, I might not get there in time. Oh, I got him. Awesome. Uh, let's uh, stay on the move here. Oh my. Oh, he just went to the moon.
I like this hands-off approach. Alright, so we're gonna save the last two specials for Loki. Alright. Come on, little alien dudes, get him! Can I finish him off with my... Oh my god! Oh, come... Oh, if you... If you get a friggin' repair... There he goes. Bye bye. <laughs> Perfect timing. Hey, my calculations have been proven co accurate. <laughs> All right, so here's Dave's cinematic. Well, he finally got to chill with the aliens and play checkers. Okay, what a way! <sighs> so, next up is Convoy. There he is, his beer belly and dynamite. The uh, uh, <laughs> name a more iconic duo than a tire and dynamite. With a beer belly. Stop a convoy. I agree. Ghost Town. Convoy is determined to send the coyotes packing. When he finds out about their hideout in New Mexico, he decides to pay Sid a visit. Let's hope the scumbag is in town. Protecting the train station. So I'm kicking the shit out of Houston 13. That was easy. I guess it had to be this way, Tenderfoot. I guess so. Canyonland. All right. I actually kind of like this map. Darn, Sid was nowhere to be found. And them coyotes are packing some serious iron. <laughs> Convoy sets out for Utah to meet up with Torque. Not far into the canyons. An ambush! Gas station. Oh my god! Just ramming Boogie? I didn't even fire a weapon other than my machine gun. Cool. Yes! Darts! Gib! Gib the darts! Okay. Have you ever seen a school bus fall off a friggin' bridge? I have. Don't want those. Bye-bye. I guess it had to be this way, Tenderfoot. I guess so. Alright, ski resort it is. Torque, one's, rah, rah, Torque warns convoy of Houston 3. 
a coyote android programmed to exterminate the vigilante leader. He injures the old man to go to Colorado, clear out for a while. Wow. Come here, Loki. I would like your weapons, Loki. You have darts. And of course you got a friggin' shield. No! Oh, okay. I didn't even see what I had to friggin' protect. I probably did, I just don't remember it, because, you know. There it is. Ah, oh, man. Come on. Oh, let's see how this goes with the... <laughs> oh, that's so good. I guess it had to be this way, And our final stop. Her convoy is the oil fields. This vacation is over! When Convoy learns of Sid's plan to destroy the Hexagon Refinery, he sets out to immediately, hopefully... He sets out immediately! Hopefully he can put a stop to this madness once and for all. Alright. I didn't even see what I needed to protect again. I'm assuming it's the, uh... What the hell? Okay. Lucky! <laughs> All right. More darts? Yes, please. Uh... Oh, of course.
Really? Is that all you can do? Oh my god. Come back here, you little friggin' shit! That's what I thought. Just stay down. Indeed it is. I hope I met the objective. I, I did! I guess so. Alright, so that's uh, that's the Vigilantes. Here is Convoy's closing cinematic. Yes! In a diesel truck. Alright his fine lady friend and they're leaving woohoo alright so in the next episode I am going to start the coyotes uh, so if you like this video rate, subscribe, like, comment, send me death threats check out the links in the description and I will catch you guys in the next video